George wanted to catch the red balloon, but it drifted here and there. George decided not to catch it anymore, but the balloon obediently followed George. George attempted to catch it again, but he missed. George continued walking forward. The dog saw the balloon. It also wanted to catch the balloon. George drove the dog away, and the balloon dodged. George had played hide and seek with the balloon. When the balloon floated over, George caught it. It then let go of the balloon, and it hid away. George went back to find it, and the balloon came out. George happily walked while holding the balloon. George needed to catch the bus, but he couldn't hold the balloon. The balloon floated in the air, and it followed the bus. When they reached the destination, all the children wanted to catch the balloon, but no one could. George went to class, leaving the balloon outside. The balloon floated in, and the teacher tried to catch it. The balloon floated into the classroom, and the teacher locked George up. The balloon bumped into the teacher, but he couldn't catch it. The balloon kept bothering the teacher, and he had no choice but to release George. A girl held a blue balloon, and the red balloon followed the blue one. George went over to catch it, but the blue balloon followed along again. The red balloon was popped by the boy. George was very saddened. The red balloon had accompanied him for many days. He took it to school every day. He couldn't bring the balloon on the bus, so George ran to school. During class, he entrusted the old man to look after his balloon. After school, he went home with the balloon. It started raining. George asked Passersby to hold an umbrella for the balloon. George didn't want the balloon to get wet. George and the balloon became good friends. Many children wanted George's red balloon, but they couldn't catch the balloon. George went to buy bread. The balloon waited for George outside the bakery. A few boys came by. They stole the red balloon. George came out and couldn't find the red balloon. The balloon had already been taken by the boys to play with. George saw the red balloon. He ran over. The balloon floated towards George. George caught the balloon, but the boys caught the rope tied to the balloon. The rope broke. George held onto the balloon and ran away. The boys chased after George. They wanted to snatch the balloon back. They surrounded George. George was caught. He let go of the balloon, trying to let the balloon escape. One of the boys shot the balloon with a slingshot. The balloon burst. It fell to the ground. 